China's Q1 GDP marks first contraction in 28 years. China's economy contracted in the first quarter for the first time since 1992, as the country's coronavirus lockdown halted manufacturing activity and spending. Data released by the NBS on Friday showed China's GDP weakened by 6.8% from the first quarter of 2019 and was down by 9.8% in seasonally adjusted terms from the last three months. Oil prices posted their largest one-day decline on Monday, slipping about 40% at one point, as storage capacity around the world runs short, prompting traders to leave futures positions. With the May futures contract set to expire on Tuesday, WTI crude oil futures fell as low as $10.96 per barrel, a level not seen since 1998, while the June contract dropped 13% to $21.80 per barrel, whereas Brent crude oil futures lost 7.1% to $26.08 per barrel. Oil prices rose above zero. Oil prices bounced back from zero on Tuesday, with the May crude futures contract falling to insignificance as investors managed to roll futures positions into longer-dated contracts. The June futures contract, however, dropped 17.5% to $16.86 per barrel, although it was off a low of $11.89, while Brent crude oil futures for June delivery shed 14.6% to $21.89 per barrel. Wednesday, April 22, 2020, U.S. Senate approves $484 billion worth of economic support bill. The U.S. Senate has passed a $484 billion worth of new support measures to help small businesses and hospitals affected by the COVID-19 pandemic, as well as to broaden testing for the virus. The bill, which will add $310 billion in a major loan program created to keep workers on small company payrolls, is now headed to the House and is expected to be approved by Thursday. Thursday, April 23, 2020. U.S. unemployment claims likely to rise by 4 million. The U.S.'s employment sector will be in focus before the bell, as weekly initial job figures are due to be revealed later in the day. Unemployment claims are expected to rise by 4.2 million bringing the overall count to more than 26 million in the last five weeks.